Okay, guys, this is the end product. Here are the noodles. Um, it is the same one, the two times spicy ramen noodles. Um, I mixed the noodles and basically with the broth of the uh, meat that we cooked in the crock pot. Um, I added some cheese and then I added the little seaweed that it comes with it and I added uh, the sauce as well. Um, I didn't add all the sauce just because it is too spicy for me, but I wanted to mix it all good um with the broth um so yeah let's go ahead and start okay guys so here we are i wanted you guys to be able to see what i'm eating i do have a spoon and a fork just because noodles are hard to eat just with the fork especially these type of noodles this ramen i noticed that it's very very long um and i don't want to cut it up well i didn't want to cut it up so See if it's still hot. Should be. You gotta mix it all up. Oh yeah, you can see that steam. It's me. I'm gonna be cutting it up. It's so tender and juicy, guys. Oh, you can still see some of the cheese on it. I added cheese on it. Oh, I make a mess every time I eat, guys. So let's go ahead and try the noodles. Did I get it off? This is my first time trying the noodles with cheese, too. So, hopefully they're good. Mm -hmm. Spicy. If I don't forget, I'll show you guys like how much of the sauce I did add. Because I'm pretty sure I added like more than half of it. I just didn't want to add all of it because if it's too... Spicy, I'm not going to be able to enjoy it. Mm. But I definitely wanted like something kind of soupy. Like, I feel like I've been eating very heavy. These last couple of days, I've been eating like a lot of meat, even though I'm eating some more again. I just feel like my meals have been feeling very heavy. Plus, with the weather that we have right now, guys. It's, I know it doesn't compare to other places where it's snowing and it's like negative 30. But, I mean, for us, we're in the 30s, 40s, 50s, and we're freezing. So, with this type of weather, you, you know, you just want something warm. Something warm. And that's what I felt like. And this is really... Oh, all I had, I wanted like either to make some rice too. Uh, rice um, with the and with the broth and the meat was gonna be so good because I I like steamed rice. I feel like it soaks up all the juices, but I don't have any rice just because I haven't been eating rice like in the last forty something days. We haven't ate rice unless it's on my cheat day. So, I don't have it. Mm. Look at this. Good. Mm -mm -mm. The broth is good. The juice. Because I, I did still leave a little bit of water. To mix the sauce obviously um but then the rest is um broth from the meat cooking in the crock pot which goes hand in hand it's good mm. it's good guys sorry Turn my and I haven't even given you guys a close up either. I'm slacking. <clears throat> Show you guys. 
I don't want to make a mess. Look at these noodles. Oh, did I catch it? Hope so. I don't want to be making a mess. See, guys, this is why I use a spoon to help me get the noodles. Spicy, guys. I just got water. That's the one thing I haven't been changing. I haven't um, drank anything. I did have milk today, but I think that messed me up. Because I hadn't drank milk in a while. Just my body's going through changes. You know, I'm down 24 pounds. Um, you know, it, it doesn't like certain things. It does. I still crave a lot of things. Look at this bite. Looks good, guys. Ooh, ooh. I don't want to lose it. Mm -hmm. See how tender that meat is? So tender, guys. Mm -hmm. can see it you know what if I had a second pack of the noodles I think I would have made it so how you guys been what's new with you guys <clears throat> excuse me guys um, my weekend's been good. Um, nothing that new. Um, today's been definitely a relaxing day. We did have a laugh in the morning, so you guys know my cousin, Dan. She's a trip. And then her cousin, I mean, um, her sister was over. My cousin Jessica was over earlier after she was done working. We were watching Jurassic World. I go into the restroom. The next thing I know is like, I hear a loud scream, super loud. So I'm like screaming from the restroom like, hey, what's going on? Everything okay? I come outside. My cousin is like cracking up, like she can't hold herself together, cracking, cracking up. And I asked her like, what's going on? What happened? Hmm. And then she's all like, check your, um, your Instagram. So I go on Instagram, I check her news feed to see what's going on. And she basically posted a video where she was holding the camera towards her sister. She screams super out loud and it startles her sister. So you can see in the video like that her sister, um, she didn't like jump out of the couch, but like she definitely got started and you can see it in her face. So my cousin is like cracking up and she posted it on Instagram. <clears throat> you know, it was just funny. Um, because it was like all of a sudden. Obviously, her sister wasn't expecting it. But then, as uh, we were watching the, our um, Instagram videos, we saw that she posted more stuff on there. And she basically, her sister was telling us. A story that happened today and I don't want to repeat it because she got she didn't want it to be under because it had to do with her job 
and her sister basically like ratted her out on what happened. That story is funny though. Ew. I wish I could tell you guys, but I can't. I don't want to get her in trouble. But it was so funny. And like we didn't even notice that my cousin, her sister, Leanne was recording. Like we didn't notice whatsoever that she was recording on her phone and she was recording everything. That her sister was saying. But we'll see. We'll see if anything happens. Hopefully not. Because she's basically saying how she kind of did something with her job. And like she kind of messed up and didn't correct it. And left it like that. But then <laughs> she also did something like towards the end. Um, so yeah, that was like hilarious. When we saw it on there, I was like, oh my God, she literally just like ratted her out. <clears throat> Ooh. Guys, if you guys haven't noticed, my nose has been so runny because it's spicy and in the broth. It has a little kick to it too. But I'm pretty sure it's more because of the two times spicy noodles. I feel my lips burning. But the noodles with the cheese is good too. You guys see my mess? I'm always making a mess when I'm eating. Gotta be careful. Hopefully this helps my stomach. Usually spicy food doesn't disturb my stomach because I'm used to it. But I just want like, you know, the broth, the warmness of it to help my stomach kind of settle down. So... You know what I've been noticing, guys? Like, basically, on Sundays on my cheat days have kind of been, like, the suckiest days of food for me because I get, like, heartburn. I'm, like, constantly... My stomach is, like, unsettled. I just hear it, like, rumbling. And it's because I'm either eating too much or I'm eating a lot of the things that um, I haven't ate in this, like, throughout my journey. So I definitely have noticed that. So... Like, obviously, I crave things and I want to eat them. But at the same time, I probably shouldn't wait for the one day out of the week to try to eat everything. Because I've definitely noticed that, I'm telling you, like, I be burping, like, 20 times within, like, um, 30 minutes. Oh. Excuse me, see? Oh. But that's just probably from this. <laughs> Um, like my stomach unsettling, the heartburn. Um, so I'm gonna try to probably tone it down a little bit, but at the same time, I get so excited and I want everything. I really do, guys. This bite's good because it has meat and the noodles. Mm -hmm. But, yeah, I think we're going to, or at least I am this week. Have you guys heard of the egg fast? Basically, for like three to five days, um, you're eating eggs. You're basically just eating protein, fats, something else. So, for every meal you're eating egg um, you can eat up to 8 to 10 eggs a day but you can only use butter oil 
butter oil, and then there was a third thing to cook it in. And obviously, it can only be one tablespoon per um, sitting. And then no more than four ounces of cheese throughout the day. Um, so I'm going to try that just because, like I told you guys, um, these past couple of days, this past week, I've been feeling like I've been eating very heavy, even though I really haven't. I just feel like I haven't been sticking to what I normally sh um, do. And I can feel it. Um, so I'm going to try that and I'll let you guys know how it goes. Um, but I'll also let you guys know if I do end up losing any weight from this previous week. On Tuesday, I'll be weighing myself. So we'll see. Hopefully. Because like I said, like I, it's not like I... I bought myself any fast food um, or ate big amounts of food. I just haven't been as dedicated as I should be. Ooh. <coughs> that went almost down the wrong pipe. I caught it though. Oh, it's super bright, huh, guys? I'm sorry about it. Ooh. I want to get all of it. It's good. Really good. Sorry guys, you guys probably don't like that noise. Of this pony um hitting the plate. I'm not gonna I'm sorry guys, that brightness is like this is just a piece of onion. I'm not gonna eat it because I don't like onion like that. But yeah guys, give me some feedback. Let me know what you guys wanna see, how you guys been, um, what you guys like, don't like. Let me know so I can continue um, with this journey as well. Because I do want to keep bringing videos. I want to keep bringing new things to you guys. Um, so make some requests and let me know. Thank you guys. I hope you guys enjoy that. Enjoy your Sunday evening with your family. Or if, even if you're by yourself, enjoy it. Relax. You know, take a nap. Read a book. Do what you want to do. Basically, that's the important thing. Do what you want to do. Thank you guys. Bye.